Wow. This makeup looks really good. And it matches my neck. You notice that? Look at me. This makeup looks really good, doesn't it? I can't see anything. On your eyes? Just the whole thing. Yeah, my whole face. I mean, I don't think that's how you have one of your eyes. Well, that's good, right? I mean, your eyes look nice. Because I have a shitload of makeup on. I can't tell. That's good, right? I mean, if you got closer, could you tell? Maybe, but I'm not getting up. Oh. Yeah, look, your eyes look nice. Don't thumbs up me. Hey, welcome back to my channel. I'm Mascara Cakes. Today, I'm doing a collab with the wonderful Audra at Home. And she is so funny and so nice. And just go check out her channel if you haven't yet. Cause she is awesome and she doesn't like to do her makeup on camera so, I so thought for I those of you that don't know makeup is not my bag i am not good at makeup that's that's those are facts i'm not good at makeup i am good at skin i'm good at a base like look at my base bitch sorry <clears throat> That's what I'm good at. But I make it, psh, get out. I'm not good at it. It's like Achilles heel. Like I can, I, I think I look all right, but I'm nobody who would like give you a tutorial on how so to put it. A lot of you are about to find out why I don't do makeup on camera and I am terrible at it. You're about to see a lot of fingers flying, brushes being used the wrong way. And I don't want to hear any shit about it, okay? Because I, I'm a skincare girl. I'm a foundation bitch. So I thought of stuff, I was thinking of, trying to think of things to do in a collab with her because she's great. And I thought of their top 10 skincare, top 10, top 10, top 5 face shit. Because she's really good at like uh, skincare and I love putting shit on my face to make it look better. That's not makeup also. That doesn't make sense. So I'm going to show you my top five favorite like moisturizers. Shit like that. Now my skin is normal to dry but not like crazy dry. But I definitely like to have a good moisturizer. Because when it gets dry it gets kind of itchy. So. Oh and one guy at a makeup counter told me once that my face looked like it was drier because I was older but then she also said I looked like I was like 23 so I was I think she just tell me shit to sell me stuff that I didn't buy but I guess that's not the point but I feel like my face is drier usually so my top five favorite face shit is number five and number five is the Lux Beauty Care face face cream from shopmissay.com they have this retinol one and then they have a collagen one that I actually ran out of and I need to get more of um, I like to use the collagen one in the morning and the retinol one at night before I go to bed because doesn't retinol clear up breakouts and shit and collagen like plumps up your face or something like that that's just how I wear I don't know but this cream is a dollar first of all that's amazing and it's it's just so it's creamy and it feels really nice on your face and it what's that called when you is it blend in it blends into your face really nice it's not oily or I don't know, it's really good, for, especially since it's only a dollar. It's 1.7 ounces for a dollar. I think it's great. I buy like two at a time of each flavor, <laughs> of each kind. But these are my favorite moisturizers. So, that's number five. Number four, I actually don't have right now because I used it all up. And I just have, I keep forgetting to buy more. 
but it's the Skin Iceland uh, cloud, cloud Cream, I think it is. That shit is fucking great. It's got a little, it makes your face tingle just a little bit when you put it on. And it's super, like, airy and light, like it's whipped or something like that. It doesn't say that on the bottle, but it just, it feels wonderful going on your skin. I don't know if they have any, like, peppermint or anything like that in the cream. But it just feels really good going on. And the little tingling feels really cool. I used that one sparingly because I liked it so much I don't want it to run out. But I keep forgetting to buy more because that's, I love that stuff. So that's number four. Another thing I like for my face are masks. They might not do anything, supposedly, but I just think they're really cool. They make it feel like they're doing something to your skin. And these are from Shop, again, Shop and Say, they're a dollar. I used to have a ton more, but I gave a bunch away for Christmas. And I've been using a bunch. But, like, this one is pore refining. I think my pores are really big. So, anything that says it'll make your pores smaller, I buy. <laughs> and this one is a bubble one. You, like, do that and it bubbles up. But I love face masks, especially from Shop Masse. They're just something fun to do. And even if they don't really work, they're fun. Whatever. I like face masks. So that's my number three <laughs> face shit. Number two, this is a newer product that I've gotten. And I'll just said primer was face shit, so that's why it's in here. The e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer. This shit is fucking great. Like I said, I think I have big pores. So this, to me, fills them in and makes them not disappear, but definitely makes them less noticeable. And supposedly this is a dupe for the Tatcha poreless crap. I don't have Tatcha money, but I do have elf money. So I don't know how well it compares to that. But for me, this works perfectly great and I love it. It's pretty awesome. And I usually like, I'll dab it in and then I'll rub it. I can dab it into the pores. I don't know if that's healthy for your face. But it works good for me. That's number two. My number one favorite face shit is Hyaluronic Acid. This one just happens to be ColourPop 4th Ray Rainfall Hyaluronic Acid Serum. This is just the one I have at the moment. This one works fine. It's got a scent. If you don't like smells or that aggravates your face don't use this but I used to use the one from oh, what's that shit called I use I mean it's whatever hyaluronic acid that you find that you like I my skin my face just drinks that shit up it's great it makes your face my face feel really soft and smooth and I love it I used to use the ordinaries hyaluronic acid but there's a weird stuff that happened and I just haven't reordered it yet. But it's in my cart in Sephora because I have free shipping from them. <laughs> but, yeah, whatever you find that has hyalur hyaluronic acid, whatever I find that has hyaluronic acid in it, I like a mask or some kind of face wash, I'll get that just because I like the way that feels on my skin. That's why it's my number one because this shit is great. <laughs> This one's kind of an extra one because I kind of forgot about it. So this is top five plus one more. This again, it's something from Shop and Say. I like their shit. Sorry. I try a lot of it because it's a dollar. I'm like, oh, that sounds good. So I'll try it. And I have talked a million times about how setting spray is a scam. You don't need that shit. It's stupid. And it still kind of is. But I got this setting spray. It was a dollar, and I was like, I'll try it. And it's, I actually like it a lot. <laughs> it it makes less transfer from my face to my glasses, which I appreciate, because getting makeup on my glasses is gross, and I don't like it. Um, 
I don't know about how if it makes my makeup last longer, but I have noticed when I do this, the powder from my face looks better after I spray this. So, I might have spoke too quickly when I said setting spray was a scam, but it's still, I think, a little bit of bullshit. But if you can get it for a dollar and it works okay, I say why not. But I'm not going to be spending more than a dollar on setting spray. That's for damn sure. So my bonus one is Shop Massey's setting spray. I know three of these things are from Shop Massey, but I really like that site. Whatever. So that was my top five plus an extra uh, face shit. Because you need to keep your face looking good, guys. Keep your skin on your face. What? What did you say? Are you making fun of me, Kevin? That was my top five face shit, favorite face shit that I like to use on my face. So what face stuff do you like? Have you used any of those five things I mentioned? What's your favorite moisturizer, serum, favorite whatever? Let me know down below in the comments. Make sure you go check out Audrey's video, which will be linked below. And thank you so much for watching. See you next time. Have a good day. Where is it? He literally just dropped on the floor. Where is it? Bring it here. James, stop. No, James, it's okay. Let me see. It's right here by hitting me in the bed. Yeah. It's already bent like this. I tried. I tried. It's not. I do you know how old this is? No. Like, it's not a big deal. Okay. This is from when I was like. Six. Doesn't mean it break it though. No, but I, I bending it. Special to be you, so that's why I tried to fix it. Oh, thank you. But bending, I think it was already bent up like this. It is, but don't bend the shit in half. No. Yeah, the, he bent it more by hitting me in the back. <sighs> no, they can still play with it, Kevin. It's a toy store. I don't care. No, oh, you have this habit of... You can still play with it. Give him the uh, fucking but sword. Because yeah, when they actually do fuck this up, I'm going to be upset because it's not even my sword, but I'm very fucking attached to this thing. Why are you attached to the sword? Because the sword used to sit... The sword sat at our fucking TV for how many years? I how know. How that fucking sword sit there until assholes 1 and 2 were born? Long time until one of them decided, like, oh, shit, I can pick this up and fuck up with it. Only Sunday, right?